You know what I love when guys tell me this? Oh my God, the most pathetic line ever. You ready? But you don't understand, Pat, you know, I'm like a nympho. And so my desire for sex is more than yours. Like, who do you think you've owned? Like this sexual desire thing? Like you think you're the only one that goes, oh my gosh, did you see? Focus, 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 go, 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 she's gone. Okay, perfect. Safe. We're safe. Awesome. We are in the same place. Right? You think you're the only one? Like, what do you think? You don't think pastors? One time I says, then I ask a question. I say, hey, hey, I mean, you know, you're a pretty good looking guy. He said, where is this guy going with this? I said, how do you deal with all these honeys that kind of like you at this church, man? You, you know, I see how some of the girls look at you. They said, Pat, it ain't easy. Boom! Look at that statement. Pat, it ain't easy. But I'm a leader. A perfect answer. That's all you need to tell me. So I didn't tell me. Like, what do you think? He cycles 40 freaking miles every time he cycles. You don't think like something happens to the testosterone level? Like you understand, like, honey, I'm coming home. Be ready tonight. Because it's like, I'm coming, okay? Tell the kids to go to freaking dinner or take the girlfriend out. Shut the door, take the dogs out, go upstairs, I'm coming home. Praise the Lord, whatever kind of music they listen to, you know. Mercy me or whatever they listen. I don't know what pastors have sex to. You ever think about that? Like, maybe I'm the only one that thinks about it. I mean, I like R&B, but I don't. What do you have sex to? It's awkward if you have sex to Christian music. Wouldn't it be weird? Have you thought about that? Like, babe, let's put some Christian music. I couldn't do it. I can't do it, babe. Change it up. Am I the only guy that thinks about these things? Or, yeah. Really? Yeah. You think so? Okay, well, we'll skip it. Lust. You ain't the only one, man. Oh my gosh, get over it. 72 year olds still get excited. Nowadays, with the amount of technology, freaking dead people get excited nowadays. <laughs> like, is that thing moving right there? I think that, that, that thing moved a little bit. Did you see it? Or what happened there? Oh, they watered the plant. That's what it is. What did he put in those plants? I saw some blue pills that were dropping in there. I don't know what's going on, but that thing moved definitely a little bit. It's a dead man that's excited. You think you were the only one that's so proud of getting excited? It's like my son, he's so proud, man. Tico's so proud. He is so proud, man. It's so weird. I'm like, like, what are you doing? Look, Daddy! Daddy, look at this thing! I'm like, Daddy, it's totally okay, Bob. He wants to go show it to Melba, to everyone. I'm like, bro, get in your freaking room, put your pants down. Daddy, look! This kid was 13 months old, already getting some at 13 months old. Like, you think you've owned this thing? Get over it. Just control. It's control. It's control. It's control. Believe me, it ain't easy. I'm telling you, I'm on the road. I have to have systems for it. I've told some of you about the systems. But after I told people one time about the same thing. He was sitting in front of me when I told them the system, and they're trying to hold their face. Were you there too? I think they're too. They're like, Pat really just said that. I said, I did really just say that. I said, just keep that system in the back of your mind somewhere. And it was the most awkward walk away from a conversation with your seal like, Those guys are pr probably mentally screwed for the rest of their lives. Okay? But I guarantee they're going to tell that story to other people. I guarantee, if they haven't already, I guarantee they're going to tell it to other people one day.